Well, we're back. Now we are. If the fishing's anything like it was the last time, we're in for quite a day. Uh, you know what? <laughs> we're back here at Mirage Adventures with James Bay Tourism. And we're flying out on the beaver today. We're going to go for some Lakers, mm -hmm. hopefully some big pike. Oh, that sounds like a great day, Ron. Yeah, you know what? Stick around, folks. We'll be right back with more great fish TV action right here at Mirage Adventures. Here we go. Flying out from Mirage Adventures, going to another lake. It's a good thing about this place. They fly into all these different lakes for different fish. You gotta get up here and try this. It's unbelievable. Here we go. First time on a beaver. That it is. Toyota Quality Service presents Fish TV. Bring your Toyota home. Brought to you by Rapala, crafted from experience. Go RV in Canada. Bring back the wildhood. Cabela's, world's foremost outfitter. And Highliner. With your hosts, Leo Stockos, Ron James, and Jeff Chizzo. I got one. Got oh, yeah. One. yeah. <laughs> that didn't take long. Oh, man. <laughs> Hi, welcome to the show. I'm Ron James. I'm Jeff Chisholm. And we are at Mirage Adventures, and we've started just about five minutes here. And look at this. I got a nice lake oh, trail already. Oh, that's a beautiful fish there, Ron. On that new shad, bud. Look at the that. Shadow wrap shad. Shadow wrap shad, the new one. Oh, nice fish. Here, I'll come to the back and get it for you. Look at that. That didn't take long. Yeah. <laughs> this place day. is uh, unbelievable, I'll tell you. No matter the species? No. That's a great Not fish. five minutes in. <laughs> you got to love this place. Well, the last time we were here, we were fishing speckled trout, and they were beautiful fish. These Lakers. Oh. This is That's great, That's a good too. way to start. Look at that. There he goes. Clear water? Gin clear water. Perfect water. Awesome. Awesome fishing. And look at what we got them on, Jeff. Got a wrap shot, the brand new bait, Rapala. That's the perfect size right there. Yeah. Perfect. They're going to hit it like that all day long. I bet you you're going to put one on. <laughs> well, I'm going to try the spoon for a little bit. Okay. We'll see what happens. You know, you fish one, I'll fish the other. If you keep hitting them on that shadow wrap, I'll be joining <laughs> you, that's for sure. <laughs> right on. Okay, so what we're doing is we're going to start back up and just troll up and down this little trough in here, about nine feet of water in between these two islands. And Man, we haven't been fishing long. There you go, buddy. I just got uh, broke off, too. Did you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we are so far up here. Oh, there is oh. nothing around but water and tundra forest. Lakes everywhere. You just got them. Oh. Ah, good nice. fish. Oh, the hook just popped out. Perfect. Beauty. Perfect. Nice, like four or five pounders. Yeah. Perfect lake trout. Long fish. I love how sharp their uh, their fins are in these. Oh, I like know. A, they got the white. Real pointy. The uh, big dot. They're beautiful fish. This shallow. lake is loaded with them. Yeah. You know, I'm used to fishing with downriggers, yeah. and dipsies, and lead core. We're fishing in shallow water here, eight to 20 feet, roughly. Back to the old school, buddy. Yeah, that's 14 great. foot aluminum. Oh, that's awesome. Nine, nine. That's rolling. Awesome. Well, let's let them go. Yeah, that's great. Beautiful. I had a fluorocarbon lead on that. Yeah. Off my bottom bouncer. Mm -hmm. I'm going straight braid. Are you? Oh, yeah. Suffix 832. I won't break them off. 
There we go. Yeah. Oh, double. Double head. Double head. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is fun, Rock. Oh, no kidding. <laughs> this fishing is insane up here at Mirage. Oh, yeah. Oh. There you go. <laughs> double header. Beautiful. <laughs> Look at that. Man, I tell you what, the fishing at Mirage and the lodge at Mirage is insane. You really have to get up here and try this. i let that one go. I lost a big one just before that. We're the only ones on this lake. There's so many lake trout in this lake. <laughs> I could just imagine. Literally, folks, we have gone what? A quarter of a kilometer. Not even. Not even. <laughs> Not even. We started trolling, right the first there. three minutes we got one and it's been steady ever since. Yeah. This is crazy. And I don't think there's another angler for a hundred miles. <laughs> uh, probably 500 miles. Yeah. <laughs> this thing is deadly. Shadow wrap shad. This shadow wrap shad, uh, they, they say smallmouth everything, but right now the lake trout are just pounding it. And that color seems to be a key. And you're getting them on the matrix. Yeah, well, you know what? It's kind of similar color. Yeah, they're almost the same, eh? Yeah, well, I've got the matrix here, but you've got the orange and the black. I've got some orange and black. Maybe that's it. I don't maybe know. Maybe that's the color. Well, you know what? Or maybe there's so many fish here, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I, I'm going to stick with what's working. Every time we make that pass, we get one. You miss one, and then we got a double. Yeah, yeah. We got to make that pass again. For sure. All right, man. For sure. This is crazy fishing. I love it. <laughs> My bait didn't even get down. <laughs> Come on, Ryan. Feisty Laker. Oh, whoa, whoa, yeah. Whoa. whoa. Didn't they tell us that there was a 27 pounder caught in this lake? 27 pounds, can you imagine? No, I can't, that's a big this fish. Cool. <laughs> you put the motor in gear, yeah. I start letting out line, you're like, oh, there's one. <laughs> <laughs>
said, you got to come back up for the lake trout. Mm -hmm. He said, the numbers are crazy. You just non-stop catching them. This place is unbelievable. The lodge is incredible. Holds up to 200 people. Uh, the food is dynamite. They've got uh, hot tubs, two hot tubs. They've got a pool table. I mean, you can just have a great time up here. There's no question about it. It's a great spot to look at. I'm telling you, it's very secluded. You're in the tundra forest way up here. James Bay tourism area. Fantastic, unbelievable fishing. I'm retired. Let's do it again. You want to go again? <laughs> Let's do it again. <laughs> uh, do you think uh, our camera guy could have lunch just for like two minutes? Because... No. <laughs> Me neither. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. I think they hit it and come with you. So I feel a thunk. Yeah, you feel a tick. And yeah. then you drop it back yeah. and set the hook. And they got it. That's what I, everyone I felt like that. Oh, oh. Here we go. They just had another one tick it. Here we go. Same spot every time. Oh yeah, that's a good fish. Oh, nice. Another one. <laughs> We're going to try to mix it up a little bit. We're going to go cast for some too. Why not? Yeah. <laughs> we could cast, Jake. I think you can catch them anyway to, here. Let me let that one so go. So many of them. It's hard to it's hard to leave something that's working, yeah. you know? Yeah, we're having a blast Once doing you it. start catching them. Our guide, Jocelyn. Okay, so we're we gonna go a couple more passes and then what? That way. That way. Okay. It's that way is better. Better? Yeah. How can it get better? <laughs> <laughs> What bait, okay. what bait do I want want for a big one? Can I? It's a blue fox. Is it? Yeah. Can I see? No. Yeah. It is. Yes. <laughs> it's for you. <laughs> it is. Rock this place. It's time for the Fish TV Tip of the Week. Hey guys, on our boats back home, we trust our Garmin GPS sonar combos. But when we're on the road, we trust our Garmin handheld units. They're great to be able to mark our best fishing spots and make sure we can get right back on those fish. When you're on your next trip, make sure you bring your Garmin. I'm Jeff Chisholm with your tip of the week. How's that one feel, Ron? That one feels good. Oh. We switch baits. Just your average eight pounder. Oh, yeah. Quality lake trout. All day long, non-stop action. He's ready. See you later, baby. <laughs> All right, I'll get mine in for you. Look at, look at, look. I like those big head shakes. I That's a good those sign, eh? <laughs> See your rod just womp, womp. It's a good fish. That's our better one yet. Look at this! Oh, oh yeah! yeah. <laughs> Very nice. Look at this! Watch, watch, watch. Look at the teeth on that fish right there. That one's been eating. Look. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Healthy fish. Watch him go, watch, watch. There we go. Portions of Fish TV are brought to you by Mercury. I just cast, you can still see the rings from my cast. I know, it's not giving me a chance. <laughs> I've never had fishing like this. Look at the spin and turn. He's all wrapped up. The old death roll. All right, he's all wrapped up. Like a gator. <laughs> Good work. Just another six pounder. What an average fish here now. It is, man. We get all kinds of these good ones. <laughs> Caught so many fish in the five to seven pound range. And I went to the salt water. <laughs> well, Ron, you're going for the numbers, but I'm going all in. I'm going for a big one. But <laughs> I switched. Yeah. And you still can't keep them. Still can't keep the smaller ones. That's off. a big spoon. Big bait, big fish. That one was probably one six and a half and it's still eating this. <laughs> well, we need lures like yours. I want a big one. <laughs> you think? Might as well. We've got so many, we might as well try to go for a giant one. <laughs> <laughs> this is ridiculous. He just put it back in the water, I man. Just, I didn't get it down. He just crushed it. Oh, You man. got a hot stick there today. This is right? unbelievable. <laughs> oh, look at that one, bud. Yeah. 
<laughs> well, that's a good fish there, Ron. <laughs> this fish, this fish is fairly heavy. Oh yeah, here we go. Oh, some better head shakes there. <laughs> He's pulling some drag. You couldn't ask for a better day. Oh, I show. Oh, absolutely full of fish. <laughs> Gorgeous weather. Gorgeous scenery. Yep. And oh, a gorgeous nice, lake trip. Nice fish. Right in on that beautiful fish. Awesome. Look at that. Okay. Nice. That was a skinnier one. Reel them in with the right tools from the Toyota Tackle Box. Okay, folks, let's take a minute of the action and show you exactly what we're using today. This is the brand new Shadow Wrap Shad. This bait worked awesome for us today. We caught a lot of fish on this bait, so you want to bring a few of these up when you come to Mirage Adventure. Also, we caught some fish on the Saltwater x wrap This is a big profile lure, worked really well up here in this clear water. Dynamite trolling that, and this Blue Fox Great Big Spoon. That works really well, as you can see up here. Caught a lot of fish on that. Now, let me talk to you about the setup. This is called a bottom bouncer. You tie your main line onto the circle at the top. This is your weight that brings it down, and you've got a leader line. Say about, oh, anywhere from 24 to 36 inches. That's going to get your bait down deep enough where these fish are. And we're trolling it on a 6'6 medium heavy action rod with 30 pound suffix braided line and a great R-type reel. I'll tell you what, you bring this stuff up to Mirage Adventure and come for these lake trout, you're going to get them just like we are right now. So let's get back to that fish TV action. Look at that swirl. This one, first cast. Did you? Yep. Really? Yep. Huh. First That's cast. cool. Ah! Oh, I just saw it. There we go. Yeah! Nice. Came up, oh. swirled out at first. Oh, Laker too, eh? Yeah. It's a good fish there, Ron. Nice cast right along the shore. Look at that cast fish. It up, I'm going to need the net I, back here, bud. I saw a big silver flash when he swirled by it and missed it. Look at him go. Look at him go. You got the net. All right. <laughs> You're gonna net your own fish. Nice. There we go. Ooh. Making casts along the shoreline. There's lake trout everywhere here, man. That's, that is unbelievable. Look at how dark that fish is. Jocelyn told us, come around this island, do some cast, and you'll probably get some lakers and some pike. Yeah. Way to go, man. Love it. Love casting for them. You troll, cast, whatever you want to do. Look at that. There you go, baby, down in that clear, beautiful water. I love it, Ron. I oh, love buddy. it. I want to get one cast. Did he hit it hard? He crushed it. Did he? Honestly, I just got whacked on that spoon. Got, oh. got him? Missed him. We traded lures, you know that. Right? Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I got your spoon, you got my x wrap now. We're a little deeper water here now. Yep. And I think that spoon might produce in this deeper water. I hope so, buddy. I think so, because before there, those fish were relating right to bottom in yep. the other spot, a little shallower water. Out here, got a feeling you might That's be expensive. on it. Yeah. Got him. Oh, got him. How's that one feel? Oh, it hit hard. On that big spoon, it's too. got some shoulders, bud. You got a big fish for a big bait there, Ron? I don't know. I think so. Okay. Oh, look at the rod. Just a pump. And look at, look at. <laughs> it's a good one. Oh, it's a fat one. Look at the size of the lure. It doesn't matter what you throw down there. <laughs> Little baits. I'm going to take off my, my uh, running shoe. <laughs> just to see if it works. Okay, look at the size of this blue fox bait. I can't even, it's longer than my hand. And that fish hit that. Look at that spoon flashing in the water. Big wobble on it, eh? Just that wobble there. Blue fox, big spoon, just dashes back and forth. There we go. Oh, missed him again. Oh, I missed him again. Here we go. How many times are you going to miss that fish, Why? Huh? There he goes. There, I got him this time. <laughs> bang, bang, bang. <laughs> you want, we got to switch. Back. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, buddy, this is insane. 
Yeah. We switched areas of the lake. You put this big spoon down in the water, which I couldn't get the fire on the other side. Yeah. Now we're in deeper water, and now the spoon is on fire. Look at this one, bud. Yeah, that's a better one. <laughs> Beautiful fish. <laughs> well, wow. that's a gorgeous fish. Let's get him back in the water. Okay, buddy. Yeah. That's a nice one there, eh? There he goes, look. Look at that, see? Beautiful. Just take your time, just hold them there. Nice fish, Ron. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> okay. We're gonna switch lures again? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Come on! Oh yeah. We just switched <laughs> we just lures switched back. back. See, it's not all you. I it's know. the blue fox. I knew it wasn't me. <laughs> I knew it wasn't me. Should have switched lures back. It's just funny how on a, the last spot, the crankbaits caught the fish. Yeah. And then we come over here, and it's a little deeper water, and the spoons are the ticket. Oh, that's a nice one too, bud. Look at the colors on it. Oh, oh, oh. oh yeah. <laughs> Buddy, that's a tanker right there. That's the biggest one of the day. Oh. I want that spoon back. <laughs> no, buddy. I think, uh, I think I'm keeping oh. it. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, that's a beautiful fish. Wow, look at that. Look at that. Let's do them burping. The yellowy golden color. Fish after fish after fish. Yes. But we should thank our guide, because our guide, Jocelyn, he has been phenomenal. Yeah, absolutely. At getting us on these big lake trips. Jocelyn LaPera, beautiful job, buddy. Thank you, buddy. Also got to thank Mirage Adventure Outdoors and James Bay Tourism. I bet you there isn't a fish that we caught today I've seen a lure. <laughs> Maybe one, but I doubt it. <laughs> we are in the middle of the tundra. It's beautiful. These people take care of you. This place is awesome. You've got to get up here and try this. It's just amazing. Until next week, I'm Ron James. I'm Jeff Chisholm. We'll see you next time right here on Fish TV. Do we really have to leave? No, they do though. <laughs> Fish TV was brought to you by Lund, the ultimate fishing experience. Your Ontario Toyota dealers, real people, great cars, and Toyota Genuine Parts. Bring your Toyota home.